Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we are playing a brand new game called For the King. It's not new, but um, it's new to the channel, um, if that makes sense. Um, we've got some people here. We're going to go with a... Um, uh, probably a hunter is probably a good idea. Hunter, blacksmith, and minstrel. Sounds exciting. We'll do that. Um, not really going to customize them. Uh, we're going to go start. Um, so basically, the good king Bronner has been slain. The once peaceful kingdom of Ferul has been corrupted by a wild chaos energy and ravaged by monsters and bandits. The grieving queen, Romerson, has called for Farul's ordinary citizens to search the land for the king's murderer and the source of the chaos energy. The tale now begins in the Guardian Forest, where there have been rumours of suspicious activity and sinister strangers in the wood. Three would-be heroes meet in Orton to begin their quest. This is where we start today. Um, so basically, this is a really cool game. Um, first the wizard Vexel vanishes, then my own husband was slain in his palace. You may be the last hope of Ferul. Um, seek out, um, oh, wood smoke, so close. Seek out, um, Hildebrandt in wood smoke. You will be told how best to aid the efforts. Your quest has become strive against the chaos, lest our realms be consumed by it. Quest objective, go to wood smoke, which is right there. So close. Um, so basically, this is a game... Kind of like Dungeons and Dragons, I would, um, I think is probably the best. Basically, you have, um, movement points. So, um, Silas, who is a hunter, has, um, five movements, so he can move five tiles. Um, so he could probably make it to wood smoke just easily like that. Um, he could also do another thing. So we're going to go to the quest board and see what we can get. Um, we can reduce chaos. We could get an item, which is a... It's not too bad, the item. Gold is um, probably not the best. Reducing chaos is always good. Um, so we'll accept that quest. Um, there's a guy there, so we'll do that eventually. Um, we have a wee while to do that over there. We expires in 20 rounds. So we're just going to make it to Wood Smoke with um, Silas. He's used his turn now. Um, Hildebrand, always good to see new faces join the quest. I am Hildebrand, the Queen's agent overseeing the things in the Guardian Forest. Things are bad here, really bad. Um, all signs are pointing to some evil folk who have locked themselves away in the glittering mines. Ooh, scary. Um, which are over here. Uh, nope, this is, uh, I'll get work down there. In the meantime, a strange contraption has been in spotted. Investigate it. So solve the cult device. Easy clap, boys. And, um, uh, defeat the Chaos Leader. And some angry folk in fancy robes have made themselves at home. Best, best prepare for a good fight. Um, so yeah, that's exciting. Um, complete those objectives in any order. We're going to get another quest. Um, probably a reduced Chaos one as well. Uh, because those are always good. Um, less angry things is always fun. We've got so many Chaos things all around. It's great. Um, okay. So, basically, I haven't really explained this game at all. I'm bad. Um, we're going to end a turn here for him. Um, Hazel is going to get a go. She's going to roll. Hopefully, nope, she didn't get full movement. Four is fine, though. Four is fine. Um, engage in combat. I don't know if we want to do that per se. We could do that. Both of us get in. So, basically, it's game kind of... Um, uh, kind of very strategic sort of role-playing-ish game, I would say. Um, some of this sounds quite loud. Sorry about that. Um, but yes, we will go for a... one of these. So, basically, you roll, basically, dice rolls in order to see how well you do in the fights, which is cool. I like the mechanic. It's great. Um, what we could do is we could draw attention probably a good idea taunt um it doesn't really do much otherwise um it's probably best to use just this um just to destroy him easy boys really really easy um so we're gonna share the gold um worn leather boots uh equip those good job um so yeah this game can also be played co-op online so with another friend or two friends 
It's a nice day, plus two movement. Um, where do we want to move to? We could go down here, sure. What is this? That is Rustic Landing. Okay, that's a place where you can get uh, vessels and stuff. So it's kind of like a big board game, really, is the best way to describe it. Um, we might go here, fight this bee boy. Um, also because um, this guy's in range. Obviously, as you can see, there's a range of combat with anybody who's in this range can be attacked at the same time. So obviously, enemies can attack and also people who are in the range of combat can also help as well. Um, so we're just going to fight. There's, they're all level 0, but it's going to give some good XP, which is great. Um, this forest nibbler is immune to water stun and bleeding, so that's kind of a thing. Also, this sound is quite loud. I'm sorry about that. I cannot fix it right now. Um, uh, do, do, do. They have no resistance, which is cool. We might go for the forest nibbler. Probably the best idea. Um, six physical damage. Perfect. Amazing. Um, always best to use, like as much as possible to um just get the big guys down first this is really loud i did not realize this was going to be so loud options we're going to change the audio just tone that down a bit especially the sound effects um maybe quite quiet but it's fine it'll be fine poisoned oh no that's not good poisoned is bad we dodged which is really cool um so speaking of dodge and stuff you have stats which are down here so there's the level there's also strength um vitality intelligence um awareness talent speed and uh luck which basically do a whole bunch of things and stuff and things and all is good we're gonna do that blocked that's unfortunate um but yeah basically they will do different things um different uh classes required basically get good at things um there's also armor and resistance and evasion and attack damage as well um it's not too like important there but um yeah wow one health okay that's cute we're actually getting quite demolished here really really demolished um we're gonna do this because i want you dead yep he's dead nice 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 pierce which is not good um, you can do that. Hopefully it'll die. Yep, it died. Nice. Critical. Not that we needed it at all. Um, so yeah. Chaos, um, which has been, like, talked about quite a bit. I'm just trying to go through as much as possible in, like, the short time that I have. Um, chaos, uh, means things get bigger. Godspread, we're gonna collect on you. Because you'll need that later in the future. Uh, nice day, you get one movement. Um, sure, we'll start moving down this way, I think is probably the best idea. Um, end turn. So, every time you end a turn with all three of them, the timeline progresses. Um, five movement again, wow, so good. Um, and as soon as we get up to this chaos, um, it means that we get one of these, which means there's going to be more enemies and things are going to be bad, and just all of that stuff in general. Um, is not the best. Um, also, I kind of forget how to move a bit. Um, arrow keys. I haven't played this in a while. I've played a bit, but not in a while. We're gonna go into this combat. Probably not the best. Um, you have stumbled upon a dark cave. Many dungeons are short, but cannot be escaped until they're cleared. Cool. We're not going into it. We are not going into that. Um, we're just gonna fight. There's no point really ambushing or anything. Um, so yeah, basically... It's, it's a great, it's a great game. I love it. I really do love it. Whoever, um, I, I don't know who the, um, designers are, but, um, it's, it's a really good game. Really, really cool. And, um, it's on Steam, so, you know, it's great. I got it in the winter sale because it was, like, half price or something, I don't know. But it's a really, 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 really good game. I got Rose into it, actually, and, um, she kind of got addicted to it, so I'm sorry about that, but what can I say? It's a great game. Highly would recommend. If you want to see more of this, let me know, and I will definitely do more of this. Um, evasion resistance, fine distance, water immunity. Um, you're going to equip that. Fishing hat, might as well. You're more of that sort of guy. You're that kind of guy. Um, so yeah. We are gonna move Hazel over here. She got... Hazel gets bad movement all the time. It's ridiculous. Hazel is not my favorite. Um, raining means that there's bad weather movement, which unfortunately limits movement, which is not cool at all. Really, really not cool. We're just gonna end there. Um, so yeah. 
really you're trying to get as far as possible and do as many things as possible in a short amount of time as possible otherwise you're screwed basically um we could do that i suppose what is this um plus 25 percent xp modifier hmm i mean i kind of like the idea of this let's um fight this there is a beastman and a pixie the Pixie has magical damage resist, which is cute. Um, you're protected from an attack, which means fully negates damage from the next attack, which is great. So we're going to get out the Pixie first. Um, we don't really need to ignore armor, but it's cool if it does. She dodged. That's great. I love that. Love it when they dodge. So cool. Fantastic, really. Um, we are going to go... We're going to have to use the... Oh, wait. Why did I do that? Okay, he's no longer protected. I meant to do that on the pixie, but that's that's fine. Silas is nearly dead as well, which is not good. We are going to use some um, uh, some God's bed to get up some of his health because I did not realize how low he was. Um, encourage. That's really good. That's a that's an ability that the uh, minstrel gets, and it basically means one of the roles. Um, one of the wee little tokens is used. You can also use a focus, um, which basically allows you to get one for free. So you can get closer chance to a crit. You have five before you need to refresh them. Um, and it's basically a guaranteed roll. So it's pretty, pretty, pretty good. Pretty useful. Um, they do cost to re, like, relearn them, I believe. So, yeah, you know, you've got to use them sparingly. But if you can, it's cool. Um, we might try to daze. We didn't, unfortunately. We did two damage, though, so it's not too bad. Um, but yeah, if you want more of this game, let me know down in the comments. Uh, there's also a whole bunch of other, um, kind of, uh, I don't know what you would call them. Uh, Goblin Polax. You've got the hunting bow, so probably not useful for you. Would probably be useful for you. We're going to collect that on you. Goblin Polax is cool. Um, you can end. <clears throat> we'll get through all of these turns, and then we'll end off the episode there. But, um, basically, wow, two movement. That is so bad. You were bad, Hazel. So bad. Um, it get, gets five, because he's a god. Um, we're gonna go for this for you, because I think you could devote yourself to that. Um, gets full health, which is great. And plus 25 XP, so really cool. Um, so that's claim. We can't use that, that anymore. Um, but yeah, we are going to end off here. So if you want a more, if you want a more, a more, just a singular more, let me know. I will do more. Um, if not, I won't. Maybe I will. Who knows? Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. If you're already subscribed, press the wheel bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember, craft outside the box.